Hey guys, welcome back to another video. And today, I don't have a face cam because I left my phone downstairs and I'm too lazy to get it. Um, but today, we have a nice Howley Evolved ETB. And I know I'm a little, uh, a lot late to the party. Um, but, you know, hard for me to get my hands on pro um, any product these, these days. So, um, you know, I'm probably not going to... Wow, this is really dull. <laughs> Release like I have in in the past in my older videos. Um, and I'm just gonna post pretty sparsely compared to that um, now. But, you know, that's, that's just how it is. And also, this is like a kind of throwback. Because, like, in my old videos, I didn't have a, a face cam. So... We're, we're back to that. Here's the uh, player's guide. And I'm sure you guys have all already seen the contents of this ETB. You know what I like to do with these? I like to uh, hang them on my, my walls. Oh, here it is. There we go. Okay. Also, I can. I apologize if you can hear any background noise. It is not an empty house right now. Um. So let's check it out. We got our our energies, of course. Pretty basic. Um. If this video <laughs> gets more than three views, or the next time, or no, I think I said the next time I'm I post another opening video, I'll also follow it up with a code card video so stay tuned for that um subscribe again because i'm once again active on this account so <laughs> i mean not really but you know you know what i mean uh poison and damage counters uh here are our sleeves you know pretty basic oh wow that's really interesting um, I was looking at this, this dice here. Um, it reminds me of one of those glass marbles. But I think this is definitely pretty interesting. I haven't seen them make a, a die like this in a while. This is focusing. Anyways, just me being a little, a little perplexed by some die. Okay, and we have nine packs. Now, to me, that feels really random. Because in special sets, they do, like, 11, right? And before, like, pre-Scarlet and Violet era, they did eight. So I just think it's kind of weird that they're doing nine now. Either way, I appreciate the uh, extra booster pack. Here is the promo card. Now, if Future Me is not lazy, I will add the price uh, in here. But here it is. Really nice. You have all three starters. And Pikachu, of course. Um, condition looks pretty good. This centering is a bit off. Uh, this this side is has more border than this side. Um, but, you know, it's not like I was going to get it graded anyways. So, um, oh, man. I left Lucario downstairs. I'm just going to rest it here, then. On my Gundam leg. I, uh, yeah, let's just start with this, and then I'll talk. Um, so I went to Indiana for a month, and I brought Lucario with me, so, um, so anyways, I was saying, I was in Indiana for a month, and uh, I brought Lucario with me, so, um, it's not here right now, it's downstairs in my backpack. Um, really interesting up there, definitely a culture shock. Uh, for me, being from Hawaii and all, it's, uh, very different. Oh my god! No way! That's sick! That is sick! Oh my god! Alright, put the price up right now. Oh my god. Grusha Full Art Trainer. Let's go. I don't even know how much this is worth prior to editing this video. Um, here it is. 
Very nice. Uh, let's check out the back. The centering is actually not that bad. It's actually really good. All right. First pull of the opening. I love getting full art trainers, especially this one. It's it's just a really cool looking one. Put that at the back. Okie dokie. Second pack. I hope that isn't the only good pull we're going to get today. Usually, I don't want to jinx myself, but usually the best card I get out of openings will be the first card. Um, like when I pulled the Rainbow Rare Mew Mewtwo GX or the Shining Charizard. I'm pretty sure those were the first pack I opened of the thing. Ooh, nice. Let's go. Gotharita. Full art. Is it a full art? I don't know what it is. <laughs> um, I'm not well versed as I once was. Um, but here we go. Not bad, not bad at all. Try to make this look a little bit more neat. Alright, I don't think this, this uh, is going to work. So I'm just going to lay it down for today's video. Wow, that one was tough to get off. All right, one from the back. Um, I've seen other people do different card tricks for the packs, but I've just been doing one, so I get the energy in the front, and then I guess you can do two and then get the hollow in the front. Um, but yeah, I think I prefer to get the energy first. Yeah. All right. We got a Fighting Energy, Krogunk, Rodoki, Magnemite, Phalanx, Azumarill, Vespaqueen, Eskew, Lokix, Tandemoss, Veluza. Alright, we're making our way through these packs. I think we're about halfway through. Five packs in. Um, yeah, Thimble, Gothelia, Arc Back. <laughs> alright, alright. It seems our, our luck streak has come to an end. Um, not to worry though, we still have four packs. I'm stumbling on this, guys. I would ask for you guys' opinion and stuff, but, like, I get so little views on this, um, on this channel that, like, <laughs> they always disable my comments, and it's so annoying. I always try to re-enable it, but it never works. Ooh, Pikachu EX. I don't know what just happened with my voice there. Anyways, Pikachu EX. Really nice. I really like that they brought back EXs. It's definitely uh, more memorable for me since I started opening Pokemon or collecting since they had EXs. Um, I think I opened some like Heart Gold Soul Sil Silver Error packs before, but you know, younger me did not take care of those cards at all and just threw them around so I obviously don't have those anymore <laughs> whatever I did pull uh, another thing I like about this set is definitely the code cards and the silver borders I think the silver borders just make it look more sleek and a jump pluff for our rare all right guys last two packs um pulls are not terrible not terrible at all. I definitely think our first pull, the uh, Grusha, was definitely my favorite so far of the opening. Um, but, you know, let's see if we can get anything else out of these two packs. Culver Sire, Tauros, Tyranitar, Mastiff, 
Gilmora. A lot of these Pokemon I'm not even familiar with. It's, it's, um, yeah. I am not in it as much. Especially since I haven't played the new Scarlet and Violet game. Um, yeah. Fue Coco, uh, Cuffins, Vespa Queen, XQ, Iono, and a Palmod as our rare. Alright, guys. Well, that is nine booster packs, ten code cards, and three and a half, two and a half pulls later. Here's my favorite pull of the opening. And here are the rest of the video. So, I hope you guys enjoyed. And I will hopefully post again. And I'll see you later.